I think that the knowledge that I come is from just interviewing the people closest to her. So with the museum, I think it's like an object, but an object's just an object unless you get that personal touch with it. So I, I was very adamant about trying to capture these stories with people that knew her, worked with her, have been gifted things from her to preserve that part of history because they're all getting older and once they pass, we're is, losing that sense of history. Is this your way so, of actually meeting her through these people? Probably. <laughs> Yeah, I when they tell me the stories, I'm just in awe of like, oh my gosh, that happened. And they, they're very private people because once you work in the royal family, they're very um, discreet. They honour that that job. They don't share stuff. So to be able to have to have access to them and for them to open up to me, I, I just feel as such a gift and a blessing. You feel like you've and met my her? job to preserve. I, I, well, I did. I met her twice. No, but I mean, <laughs> oh, I see. So I see. I have met her. Yeah, I, she shook my hand twice and the Sydney the same thing. She looked up, shook my hand. When she looks at you, 